Mike Parnell, ITI. I wanted to introduce you to a new program we've got going out here. It's Assembly Disassembly Director. Part of the new OSHA code talks about the requirements for an Assembly Disassembly Director's skills and competency and capabilities. There's three primary parts to being an AD Director, and that's to be able to understand what the prohibitions, cautions, and warnings are from a manufacturer. Also to have the corporate guidelines in place as to how the company will manage its assembly disassembly process. And the third is to be able to fully run through a complete checklist on either the assembly process or disassembly according to their specifications. And in lieu of that, you'd use a qualified person's checklist for complete uh, detail and outline for each element, each step, all the way through. This program is being run here at Woodland, Washington, and it is certainly available out on site and on location. It really doesn't matter where the cranes are at, whether it's a general industry or construction site or maritime, cranes don't know where they're working. But we do know that people get injured and people get killed because of improper procedures on taking booms down or reassembling. This same process is really required for hydraulic cranes. And you'll notice in the background, as we swing over here, notice in the background we got a tall jib up in the sky right there. And that tall jib is part of a grove crane that we've got on the property. And that assembling and disassembling of that jib extension is just as important as a big lattice boom like we have behind us. If your operation involves putting cranes together or taking them apart for mobilization, you want to make sure that your AD director is properly trained and capable and competent to be able to perform that kind of work. We need to have a qualified rigger, signal person, qualified operator. We need the whole team to be able to come together to be able to achieve a project like this. Well, this is Mike Parnell again with ITI. Have a good day and take care. Thanks. Bye-bye.